Hey guys, it's Harry Styles Heather, and I am 25 weeks pregnant today. I was really, really trying to get to 24 weeks, and I tell you guys, it flew by. We've been so busy. We've been trying to get Claire potty trained. They went camping recently, and then this weekend is get this week and weekend is getting really busy. But I'm like, I've got to get to my 25 week pregnancy vlog. I can't leave them 25 weeks and over halfway. And she's, I feel like she's gonna be here tomorrow. It's so crazy. It's getting here so fast and this pregnancy is just full on by it really really is i just cannot believe i feel like it's just because we stay so busy and then i'm just like what she's going to be here for it and then the girls are going to be so excited they love they're like i just can't wait for her to get here i just want to hug and kiss on her and hold her and it was so funny the other day if you guys saw that vlog which is oh because it was like i want to hold her first <laughs> Seriously, I love that vlog. I've played that over and over again. And we've been watching some vlogs on our TV now. And so when I did edit the camping vlog recently of them, I showed them and that was really cool. And I love just seeing Kinsley's face and her reaction to her video. It's just so awesome. Like, I just love vlogging. And even more now that Kinsley's getting older and realizing, like, what's going on and just so much fun and just to look back on just like this we're gonna look back on this video and this baby girl we would have looked back when i was 25 weeks pregnant with her and everything that was going on and all that kind of stuff it was really cool when we went to the doctor's appointment so i'll talk about that first i guess it was really cool i was really excited that kinsley could go and hear her heartbeat and you know we'd been talking about it at lunch and if she had any questions that's the doctor that she could ask her because she's always got really cool questions to ask and she did about her baby sister she wanted to know how big she was and she was trying to show her that she was like a pound like now this week I think she's getting closer to pound and a half but was trying to show her and then she was trying to figure out how she was in my belly like figuring out how she's that big and in my belly and it's so funny just to see her thinking and her mind going and trying to figure everything out and that she's healthy and the heartbeat sounded really good she even asked how uh, fast the heartbeat was which is really good um, it was about 140. So if you want to see that vlog, if you haven't seen it yet, I'll leave, I'll try to remember to leave a link here. Or it's one of my recent videos. So, so I weigh 129 now, and I started out at 112, so I've gained 17 pounds. So they said that was great. Great, nothing to worry about. Everything was good. Um, cause I'm over halfway now, and I've gained that much. She said it was great. It was good. And as far as all of the testing that they've done when they test your blood and stuff she said the sugar and all that kind of stuff was looking good i don't know exactly everything that she meant but i guess just everything they've done so far is looking great but my next doctor's appointment um is in three weeks now two weeks i think is when i do my gestational diabetes test so i'm very curious about that because i had it last time with claire so i'm just assuming i'll have it this time but I don't know because I've been trying really hard to eat healthier, to eat a lot healthier and not drink so much sweet tea and drink more water and not have any sweet stuff, like too much desserts or too much, I guess, like pasta and stuff. I've been trying to eat more grilled chicken or fish and just things like that. I still have been craving fish, like seafood. This girl must love, it's going to love seafood. Uh, Claire Kindly loves seafood. She loves crab legs. She recently tried salmon that my mom had. Went out to eat the other day and she loved it. But yeah, and I've been keeping up my workouts. I've been trying to work out at least two times a week, like normal. I've recently just been going one time a week, but we're actually starting a new gym. So I'm going to start, me and Joel's going to try to start going back more frequently. But just doing my normal workouts and it's still feeling great. I love working out when I'm pregnant and I still just like, I don't know, I just always like to go in and then once I go, I feel really good. Even that up feels really good this time. Just trying to stay healthier and just trying to do better with those things so that when I do have the test coming up that hopefully I will pass it and not have it this time. I'm really hoping so because I feel like I've tried so hard. But if I do, I'm not going to be that down on myself because I feel like I had it last time. Possibly even had it. With Kinsley too. I was just like right at the line of it. Yeah, so we'll see soon. I mean, either way, it will be fun, but I will be finding out that shortly. But, I mean, if I do, I'll still be keeping up the same. What I've been doing, just trying to eat healthier, and I'll be happy that I went ahead and started eating healthier at the beginning of this pregnancy and 
and throughout and that I've kept up with workouts. I'm really proud about that because I'm still trying to keep up with everything. It is getting a little bit harder having a big belly now, like doing certain things. I'll do something and I won't notice my belly's there and I'll be like, oh yeah, I'm pregnant. And it's so funny because people do, they like stare at you because they're like, they don't ever see anybody pregnant in the gym. And so it's really weird. Like I never really see anybody pregnant in the gym, but I just keep doing my thing, just do whatever. But I do feel like that does cause attention to me and I'm like, I just want to do my workouts, get in and out. And sometimes I can just tell people I like, I can't believe she's working out and she's pregnant and like especially the guys will be over there doing like these big weights and then I go over there and do my little weights with my arms or whatever or do squats and then they're like I can tell they're like looking at me like this like it's so funny and I cannot uh, of course I know they're thinking like she's pregnant and she's in here what <laughs> so funny oh yeah so she's starting to look more human now she's starting to look like like if she got here right now she'd be super tiny but she would look like a real little baby now and so that is really cool that she's starting to really look how she's gonna look when she gets here and I'm so curious what she's gonna look like oh my gosh I want to know like her facial features you know like Kimberly she's gonna look Claire I mean they look similar but their hair is different and I'm very curious about that because I do the hair I just think that's really cool like Kinsley's hair is more wavy and thick like mine and then Claire's is a little bit thinner and it's just stick straight. Like I never brush hers or anything, it's just straight. But Kinsley's can get really big and wavy. Their hair tops are so different and their personalities are so different. So I'm really curious when this girl gets here, if her hair will be like one or the other, if she'll look a little bit more like one or the other, act a little bit more. I feel like she's gonna be like Claire just because Claire has Kinsley to look up to. And now this one's gonna have Claire and Kinsley to look up to. So really curious what she's gonna look like what she's gonna act like just i love it and i love having all girls i'm like so excited to have all girls and they're just gonna be able to share everything we're gonna be able to go do girly stuff do our nails done go to movies go shop and all that kind of stuff especially when they get older that's gonna be really really fun they're gonna be like my best friends like absolutely they're gonna be each other's best friends and all that kind of stuff and i feel like out of one you know, maybe one will be a little sporty so Joel can do like his sports kind of stuff with them. And I feel like Claire's a little bit more sporty, like she loves to run around and when she falls she just gets right up back up and keeps going because she's gotta like keep up with Kinsley. And this will not be like that too. Uh, I feel like Kinsley is pretty girly-ish. But she does love camping and stuff like that. She loves basketball like Joel. We'll see as the girls get older. Hopefully we can keep up the daily vlogs and <laughs> watch them grow forever who knows how long we'll, we've been doing that for uh for four years going on five years now so that's crazy like to think that we've been doing it that long but it's really awesome i still i absolutely love it and yeah i can't wait to see how our family grows it's so awesome baby, and the baby can also listen to music now or like hear really hear us and i feel like she does kick a lot when the girls are right at her like at my belly talking and stuff and everybody has felt her kick now so Kinsley was super excited when she felt her kick for the first time and then she's like oh I really felt that I felt that kick because before she was like I felt her kick but I was like I don't know if you did or not but now I really do she moves so much when I just like lay on the couch and I love that feeling I'm gonna miss that too just feeling those little kicks and punches and movements and all that kind of stuff um but then Claire felt her, and Dad did too, but he's like, ah, Dad thinks it's like the weirdest thing. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it other than names. We still, so we've pretty much got her two names, and, um, you know, I don't want to say much about them, but we still haven't looked at like a bunch of other names just to make sure that we have her name down. But the two names that we have, I'll just tell you this, they kind of rhyme, so we can't use them as like a first and middle name. We have to pick one of them and then pick a totally different middle name, and we have no idea for middle name yet, so like, we're still trying to decide on their name. I don't know when exactly we'll figure out her name, but yeah, I just feel like I'm getting so big, so I'll show you guys my belly now, and because it real, I really am. I'm like literally in maternity clothes now, guys, like no turning back. I'm in maternity clothes. I got all my maternity clothes out. I, have, I already have a maternity bathing suit. That's great. Oh yeah, I've tried before. 
I was able to wear like some of my regular jeans or shorts, but now, no way. I feel like my hips have gotten wider this time, I guess. Like, I don't know, or they're just not comfy at all. Like, I'm just, I'm wearing the leggings this season. Like, leggings have been in right now. They're really all I've been wearing is leggings. And then I got my maternity stuff out, and I was like, yes, feels so comfy too, having the bands with my pants and all. This pregnancy, I'm just wearing leggings and maternity stuff, and I'm not turning back to my clothes until after this pregnancy. So I'm not gonna worry about it until afterwards. I just like being comfy, and I'm just a comfy girl, so that's just what I'm gonna do. So I don't have that many, like I only have this pair of shorts. Um, I have another one other pair of shorts and like two capri pants and then I have all my leggings, I have tons of leggings and I can always wear those. And yeah, and I feel like the summer is just gonna fly by. We literally have um, June, July, August. And she could be here in August. I don't know, she might be here early. So we've got like three months or less pretty much. So that's crazy to think about because we're here at the end of May. So to think the whole summer, we have June, July, August. And then to think she's gonna be here by September. Like, cause before with Claire, I felt like it was, like, I thought she was gonna be here maybe September, but definitely by October. And so now I think, just a month earlier, I don't know if it seems so much sooner. Yeah, I just feel like she's gonna be here in my time. But anyways, I'll stop talking to head out. <laughs> like I've talked so much in this pregnancy vlog. So sorry guys if this is a long one. Um, I will try really hard to get to next week's. If not the next week for sure. And I think that will be when my gestational diabetes will be. Or it will be right before. I don't know yet how that will play out. Because um, this pregnancy I'm just playing in my ear. And I'm just trying to get to you guys and get the videos. There's lots of other videos that I want to get to. Other than daily vlogs. And I try so hard. And then I feel like I just get so busy. And then I stick with daily vlogs. And then I'm like ah. I just want to do so much more with my YouTube channel, but I tried to really hard to get to some more before we have this other baby, and then I'm gonna have three girls and me, so And we've got our new business that we're trying to start up too, along with all this, so it's so crazy. If you wanna hear more about that in our daily vlogs, and I can't wait to tell you guys more about that too, so. Okay guys, so here's my fellow. I'm getting so big, crazy, 25 weeks, and I'm definitely, my maternity clothes now. So, it's my maternity shorts, my favorite one. So, okay, guys, so I have no idea where my measuring tape went to. So, if I do find it, I will measure then and I'll put that clip in here. But I have no idea where it's at. I guess the girls took it somewhere. So, so I'm not sure if you can see me that well, but I just found my measuring tape, so I'm going to measure my belly. Right quick, we just went home cleaning, so sorry for the tire, but I found this while I was cleaning, and I was like, we were trying to clean up day. I just got done at the salon and came home, and we just been relaxing, and then we started cleaning, because girls had friends to come over and play. But anyway, so here's my belly again. I'm still 25 for a couple more days, maybe 26 weeks. So crazy, so... I'm like right 36 inches or a little bit more. So, yeah, that's pretty much where I'm at now. So, just want to show you guys that real quick. And yeah, just clean up. But we will get back to the vlog now. She's still doing good. And we we'll get back to the pregnancy vlog. So, or I guess there you vlog. But here's my Bella. Can't believe she's getting so big. And still that it's not a girl. We're still thinking about names. What should we name you? That's a girl. What should we name her? Is she so low? And the girls all the time want to know where is she? Look like, where's her head so they can kiss her head. And she kicks me all the time right here. Look like, right like lower. Like right in this section she kicks me all the time. So I'm thinking that's her feet over here and then maybe like her head somewhere over here. But my placenta is up here. And that's what's making my belly lower okay, so they always want to kiss me over here but I do feel some um, kicks or punches over here every once in a while but mostly right in this section but the girls just love her and want to kiss on my belly all the time it's so sweet I'm gonna miss that when I'm not pregnant anymore than kissing on my belly all the time because that's like my favorite part hugging and kissing on me and then she'll be here and then they'll be hugging and kissing on her 
So. <laughs> so guys, we will see you guys soon. Hope you have a great day. And subscribe, comment, like. If you subscribe, make sure you hit ring the bell so that you can get some more notifications. You'll be the first ones to find out like whenever I upload a video or what's going on. So yeah, so thanks so much and we'll see you guys soon. Bye!